All right, so I got the concept design here done. I wanted to make sure everything's gonna kind of work. And these will hit this, because your frame would be about here. So, there's plenty of room under here and stuff. I just did it like this and wanted to see how it's gonna line up and all that kind of good stuff. I think this is going to be pretty decent. So this is what I was talking about the cover. And as you can see it goes through nice. So I am actually thinking I'm going to mount it off the bottom of the case cover here. I'm going to drill a hole in a hole and mount it inside there. Since there is room to bolt it in. So that's an option, and I might make this come off there, and instead of this big one, since they put out the same voltage, I'm going to do this one, which means I can get it about there. I can tuck it that close to the case. So, let's see. I can put it right there. So, that's a hell of a difference, and that should clear for all the uh, bike frame. So, I'm going to use one of these. This is uh, 18. That's a 23. So, you can see. It's actually that much difference. So, yeah, about there it'll be. Do a different pulley for this. Maybe keep the same. I don't know yet. We'll figure it out in a minute. But uh, concept wise, that's why I like the 3D printer. Oh yeah, and this is to keep it so it wouldn't move. Like if it's pulling, cause it's gonna, so I put those in this one to see if it would work. But I think I'm gonna mount it right off this. <coughs> so, all right, peace. All right, here we go. This is gonna be badass. All right, let me go get the, uh, whew. All right. All right, so we're back here. We're working on something here, <laughs> but um, that's an e-bike light, doing good, I got it dropped enough, um,
got the rectifier and all that set up. It's 1700 RPM. Two leads up to it. And it's running the lights. This is funny. Uh, not bad. So yeah, that's it. Just running it right to the uh, where the battery would go normally. So pretty cool. This does work though. So, anyways, I got my uh, mount all done. So uh, we'll continue. Okay, so here's where we're at. Um, as I, yeah, I took the little rectifier I made off. It does work. Works great. I'm actually going to put it in here. I'm going to get a little pass through and stuff and wire this and make it look sharp. And then I'm going to put it up in here. There's space up in here. And then I'm going to run the wires out here. Uh, two other wires to run the light kit. So that is how I'm going to do it. Uh, I checked everything about the mounts. Um, there'll be a CNC mount on this. So it comes out about yay big. And then the one on the back is actually cut. For the frame that I was going to use it on, I cut it all off. So, you know, missing yay much and all that good stuff. But anyways, the stock one and that, it, it should fit perfect. I can always make one if it doesn't. But uh, it's going to go on a gas bike frame. But anyways, here's where we're at. I got my power gen build done. We'll see how it works. Eh. So, anyways, stay tuned for updates. But uh, for now, it's done. Everything seems to be, uh, you know, workable. So, alright, peace.